Ahlan wa sahlan, and welcome to Edupedia World Videos. Intermediate Arabic, with your instructor, Laura Al-Albani. In this lesson, we'll be learning how to ask why questions, and to answer them, because. The way we say why in Arabic is limada, limada. If someone asks you a why question using limada, there are three choices that you need to answer. You can use either li, bisabab, or liana. Again, those choices are li, bisabab, or liana. So what's the difference between the three choices? Let's find out. Li means in order to or for. Lienna means because. And bisabab means because of. Let's find out how to determine which one to use and how to use them. Let's begin with li. Li is used with the mazdar or al fa'al al mudara, the present tense verb. It means in order to or for. Li is used to express a reason or purpose for doing something and corresponds to the English in order to or for. In this construction, li may be followed by a masdar, which should be definite, either with alif lam or in an adafa, or it may be followed by fa'al al-mudara, the present tense verb. Both constructions mean the same thing. al masdar tends to be a bit more formal in style than al-mudara. Look at the following pairs. Edrusu lil hasul ala bacalorius. Edrusu lil asalu ala bacalorius. In the first sentence, you're using the mazdar. I study in order to obtain a bachelor's degree. In the second sentence, you're saying the same thing, but this time, instead of using the mazdar, you're using the present tense verb. Edrusu li asalu ala bacalorius. In the second set of examples, we have yadhabuna ila al maktaba lil dirasa. They go to the library in order to study. You're using the mazdar. In the second example, yadhabuna ila al maktaba li yadrusu. They are going to the library in order to study. They're both the same meaning, but one uses the mazdar and the second one uses the fa'al al-mudara. Let's look at the third set of examples. Ukhti tadrusu lil hasul ala daktura. Ukhti tadrusu lil tasalu ala al-daktura. In the first example, you're using Al Hasul Ala, the Mazdar. My sister studies in order to obtain the doctorate degree. In the second example, you're using the present tense verb, Tasilu, instead of Al Hasul Ala, to give the same meaning. So remember that Li is always used with the Mazdar or the present tense verb. Now let's look at how we use bisabab. Bisabab means because of. It's used to give a one word explanation. Bisabab is used with ism fi idafa. Let's look at some examples. La uhabu Medina jidda bisabab al istaham wa atax. I don't like the city of Jidda because of the overcrowdedness and the weather. Bisabab means because of. In the next example, we have Uhibbu al Kharif, Bisabab al Jo al Jamil. I love the fall because of the beautiful weather. Remember that when you use Bisabab, it's never followed by a full sentence. Now let's look at how we use Li'anna. Li'anna is used to give an explanation that requires a full sentence. We use li'anna plus jumla ismiya. So li'anna 
is always followed by a full sentence. Let's look at a couple of examples. La yuhab shita fi Rusia la anna atax fihi barajidan. I don't like the weather in Russia because the weather in it is very cold. Atax fihi barajidan is a full sentence. And for this reason, we use li anna. In the second example, we have la yathabu ila al jamia al yom li annahu marid. He's not going to the university today because he is sick. La annahu maridun is a full sentence, and for this reason, we're using li anna. Notice that. If the jumla ismia that follows li anna begins with a pronoun, in this case hua, the pronoun must be added to li anna. Let's examine the chart to see how this is done. If you want to say because I, you say la anni or la annani. If you want to say because you, for a male, we say li annaka. If we want to say because you for a female, we say li anniki. If we want to say because he or because it, we say li ennahu. If we want to say because she or because it, we say li ennaha. To say because we, we say li ennana. Because you plural, li ennakum, and because they. Li ennahum. Now it's your turn to use what you've learned. You need to fill in the blank with the correct choice. Use either bisabab, li enna, or li. Let's look at the first sentence. Yev habuna atulab ila al maktaba blank mushahidat al filam al jadid. The students are going to the library in order to watch the new movie. Let me read the sentence again in Arabic. Yev habuna atulab ila al maktaba blank mushahidat al film al jadid. Would you fill in the blank with bisabab, li anna, or li? The correct answer is li. We use li because of mushahida. Remember, mushahida is a mustar. Did you get it right? Great job! Let's look at question number two. Again, you want to fill in the blank with the correct choice: bisabab, li anna, or li. Listen as I read the sentence: La amalu el yom, blank, endi imtehanat hada lisboa. I'm not working today because I have exams this week. I'll read the sentence again in Arabic: La amalu el yom. Blank endi emtehanat hada lisboa. The correct choice is li anna. Li anna. I don't work today because I have exams this week. I have exams this week. Endi emtehanat hada lisboa is a full sentence, so we have to use li anna. Let's try one more. Zojati daimen mashgula. Blank shugal al bait. My wife is always busy because of the housework. I'll read it again in Arabic. Zojati daimen mashgula blank shugal al bait. Do you want to use bisabab, li anna, or li? The correct answer is bisabab. We use bisabab because it's followed by a one-word explanation. Shugal al bait, housework. Now let's quickly review what we've just learned. If someone asks you a why question using li mada, you can answer in three ways. First, li. Li is used with a mazdar or a present tense verb. You can also answer with li anna. Li anna is used with a full sentence, and finally. You can use bisabab. Bisabab is always used with a single word answer, 
or a phrase, but never with a full sentence. So now you know. Try and use what you've just learned by asking friends some why questions and have them answer. And that brings us to the end of our lesson today. Ma salama.